Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm a gloss, gloss donut, gloss, glossed, glazed donut today. Oh my God. Awkward, 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 freaking awkward. I make glazed donut today. Um, you guys saw my video earlier yesterday of this bitch. How I waxed it this morning. Well, I did my breakfast. I was going to do today a eat with me today. But actually, when I get home tonight, I'm going to do a video of us, you and I, having dinner together. So stay tuned for tomorrow's video because it's going to be of us, you and I, having dinner together. Um, I'm going to show you my burrito recipe. My Korean, Mexican, Dominican burrito that I like to make for when I am starving, but I wanna be skinny, bitch. Um, so then, I wanna to talk to you a little bit about today. Like today, honestly, I feel, it's my third week of school and my boyfriend is at home. <laughs> so sad because I feel like, I don't know, I, I, I don't think you guys know, but I miss him so much already and to me, my boyfriend is kind of like my rock in a way. Like I like having him around. And although I love when he's away and I'm by myself, I do my own thing. Everything that I eat is the things that I like, not the things that he like. Because I do think that you should prioritize yourself in a relationship, which I do always. I do also prioritize what he likes, just like he prioritizes what I like. And whenever he's home, I try to cook most of the time, but I also let him cook because fuck him. I am not going to cook for him all the time. I'm, I get tired too, bitch. So um, when I'm in school, he doesn't, I don't cook for him, obviously. Like he cooks for himself and for me. He does the dishes. He does like all the housework when he's here. <laughs> and when he's, when I'm not, okay, so he does everything, but I do do everything too. It's hard to explain our dynamic because I don't want you guys to think that I don't do shit. And he doesn't do shit. And then I do everything. He doesn't do everything. It's not like that. Uh, like, for instance, in the last two weeks, he cleaned the house twice. Because we clean every week. And he always does laundry. And then last week, the entire week, he washed the dishes. Like, all the all every day last week. I didn't do shit in the last two weeks. Because I started school. But last yesterday, for instance, yesterday... I he wasn't gonna be home obviously, so I cleaned basically for myself. But I cleaned the house while he was doing laundry. Um, I cooked dinner a couple of days ago, so Friday, Saturday, and Sunday I cook. And you know, like we divide responsibility. We don't. Really, like, I do most of the. I do most of the responsibility, but I also let him do it too. If he starts doing something, I'm not the one that says, oh, don't do it, my love. I'll do it. Of course fucking not. He's allowed to do shit in the house, too. Because although we don't, we're not in a 50-50 relationship, bitch, um, I do think it's important for a man to help you do the household work, even though if he works full-time and you don't. Because when you have a child with that man, then you're expected to do everything for the family, bitch. And I'm not about that. I... He, before I moved in, he used to do his own cleaning, his own laundry. He's on everything. So why he needs to stop because I moved in? Fuck no. Um, same thing with paying the bills. He was paying his bills before I moved in. So why do you have to stop? And you know what I mean? <laughs> you know what I mean? But... No, like I like I treat my man like a king. You guys know, well, you guys don't know, but I'm telling you that I treat my man like a king. My man, my boyfriend's skinny in my house, but king also have responsibilities, you know. So that's that. Um. Anyway, so um, last night <laughs> I was doing homework, and after I finished cleaning the house, I was doing homework and doing my thing. So I didn't spend a lot of time with him. I literally fell asleep. Once I got to bed, I got to bed like at 8.30. I was already knocked the fuck out by like 8.45. I don't even remember. I know I was asleep by that. 
I woke up this morning tired as fuck. I don't know what's going on with me all day today. Tired AF. Um, I don't know what life is right now. And I'm ready to go home. But my sister tonight, um, I finished class at 5 20. My sister's gonna meet me over there outside um at my school's train stop and she's going to come and she has to pick up something for me so i told her that i will drop her off to my parents house so after i finish school i'm going to my parents house but i'm not staying over for a long time because i have a lot to do tonight bitch i have so much school work to do tonight this um weekend i actually relaxed um who the fuck do i think i am to relax I don't know why I was relaxing until Sunday because, bitch, I had so much that I had to do that I just didn't do because I thought that I could, I, I didn't have to do it. And then me thinking, oh my gosh, you're pro procrastinating. Like, always, bitch. Like, why are you always do this to yourself? So now I'm like not freaking out. I don't have to freak out. But to be honest, I'm not freaking out because I can, I know I can get it done. But I'm just annoyed because why the fuck did I wait it until... Hold on, let me take my um, supplements. I forgot the name of the supplement that I take, but it's good for you. Anyway, so my crazy... So basically, long, to make a long story short, bitch... Um, wait, oh, um, I have so much to do tonight because of my lack of planning. So tonight I have a homework that I need to finish that I started this morning that I didn't realize that it was due tonight. Like, who am I? Oh, am I okay? I also have an Excel, um, thing to do. Then I also have to do homework for the okay. Then I have to review, and then I have to do work on so, certain like formulas that I have to put on itself for my upcoming exam, and then review and do homework for my finance fi finance class because I have finance tomorrow. And then tomorrow there's another an, a whole other shabako bitch. Tomorrow, I have to stay in school after fucking work and not work after class to work on Wednesday stuff. So I'm going to try to get a bunch of stuff done tonight. So I don't have basically close to none to do on on Wednesday. And Wednesday, I can basically relax because Wednesday, I have to wake up so damn early, bitch. Like honestly, I do this to myself, and I have no one, no one to blame but myself. Like I am the issue, and I acknowledge that. But I am the issue, bitch. Um. Okay. Like, what is happening here? Like, what is this? Like, I know that I am the issue. You guys know that I am very accountable. I take accountability for my actions. Okay, but that's that. Okay. Last thing I want to talk about today is. Have you guys have been watching that show, um, The Secret Life? Is it The Secret Mormon Life? The Secret Life of Mormon Wife. I think that's, I think that's a show. Oh my God, it is. It's called The Secret Lives of Mormon, Mormon Wives, bitch. This show has me on a choke hold, bitch. Honestly, I am extremely, extremely, extremely um, invested. You guys didn't know anything about it? Please like comment down below if you guys know anything about um, the secret lives, of, like of the mom talk group thing, people. Because honestly, like, wow. Like, I, I'm just in disbelief of, like, how great. Like, honestly, like, housewife what? It's like, whoa. It's a lot. I know it's a lot. And, you know, whatever, fuck it. But, bitch. Like, all I have to say is, bitch. Bitch. 
Wow. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just looking for the deals here. Oh my God, I feel exposed. Fuck. You guys. Like, excuse fucking me? Suck my big dick. Okay, anyways, yeah, like I am honestly like obsessed with the show. Um <laughs> I'm trying to binge watch it, but I'm just so busy, bitch. Like tonight when I get home, I won't be able to watch because I'm gonna get home. I'm gonna have dinner with you, obviously. It's time for me to go to class. Oh yeah, it's time for me to go to class. You guys wanna hear my professor? He's like the cutest. Hold on. I'm gonna get into class and he's gonna say hi to me and you guys are gonna be like, well, he's like the cutest little guy ever. I'm gonna have you like right here. I'm gonna get into class right now. Wow. <laughs> Am I okay? Okay, you guys, let me see. Today, I, which one is it? Oh, the four o'clock one here. You guys want to hear him he's the cutest little thing like honestly i'm obsessed with him he's so nice i love him so much wow bitch i hate when well you guys don't really know what's going on to whatever okay listen i'm playing in right now lunch meeting oh fuck i forgot to study Hello. Hello. How's Fennel doing? Good, how are you? All right, thank you. That's nice to hear. Your beautiful day outside. It is gorgeous out. So why are we indoors? Um, because <laughs> I needed a quiet place to attend class. You know, in the old days, Socrates used to meet his students under a tree. Wait, I think I heard about that. 